Red Sox update. Tuesday, August 13, 2013. The Red Sox win in 11 here. After losing three out of four in Kansas City, the Red Sox travel north of the border in Toronto, Ontario, Canada for a date with the Toronto Blue Jays. And the game was scoreless through the first four innings. And then in the bottom of the fifth inning, the Toronto Blue Jays got on the board first on a JP and to be a single on a ground ball to left fielder Danny Nava and Brent Nari scores and it was one enough in Blue Jays through five. And the score would stay that way until the top of the seventh inning. That's when the Red Sox get two runs. First, Jacoby Ellsbury singles on a sharp line drive to center fielder Emilio Bonfacio. Will Millibert scores, and the game was tied at one to one apiece. And then Dustin Petrua singles on a ground ball to right fielder Jose Bautista, and Jacoby Ellsbury scores. And the Boston Red Sox take a 2 1 lead. But that would change in the bottom of the eighth inning on a JP Arensabia homer on a fly ball to left field. And the game is even Steven at 2-2 two to two apiece. And the game would stay that way until the top of the 11 inning. That's when the Red Sox get two runs on a Shane Victory and single on ground ball to center fielder and Mill Button Fussier that drove home. Jared Saltmonkey and Jacoby Ellsbury as the Boston Red Sox pull them. Win out of the hat as they defeat the Toronto Blue Jays. 4-2 to two to go to 72-149 on the season. As as the win for the Red Sox. As Koji, you uh, get the victory, go to three and zero in season. And Aaron Loop was saddled with a loss. For the Blue Jays. Next up for the Red Sox will be in Toronto for game two of a three game week for a three game series here. With with John Lesnar man for the Red Sox. Blue Jays yet to decide a picture. Alright, let's take a look at our Major League Baseball scoreboard. In the bottom of the eighth inning, it's the Yankees leading the Los Angeles Angels 12 to 3 in the bottom of the eighth inning. Top of that seventh inning in Washington, it's the Washington Senators 3, the Washington Nationals 3, the San Francisco Giants 1 in the top of the seventh inning. In the bottom of the seventh inning at Wrigley, it's the Cincinnati Reds and the Chicago Cubs to a 4-4 tie. That game just going into the top of the eighth inning. And we got a score update. The Yankees get two more runs, they lead it 14 to 3. In the bottom of the seventh inning, down in Texas, Texas Milwaukee fourth, Texas one going in into the top of the eighth inning. In the final was Cleveland five, Minnesota two. Going in the bottom of the seventh inning was Chicago Cubs leading the Chicago White Sox leading the Detroit Tigers three to two. In the bottom of the seventh inning, we are going in.